Today I'm going to show you a Lush Fresh Handmade Cosmetics Summit 2018 product and this one is called Peace Pioneer and it's a new uh, solid shower oil and this one was made with cocoa and uh, you know cocoa powder and um, cocoa butter and shea butter and other moisturizing things and they made this in the scent of their butterball uh, bath bomb that they sell in all the stores so it smells like uh, chocolate and vanilla and it's a light a lighter scent it's not it's not too light it's a medium light comforting sort of yummy cocoa scent and it's uh, very moisturizing I love the way this looks with the peace sign on it. That's what it looks like on the other side. And they call this a regenerative shower oil because the ingredients that were made, the ingredients that this is made from were bought from communities around the world and the commerce that goes into that community regenerates that community. So that's why they call them regenerative shower oils. And they're all part of the Naked uh, group of products that Lush has been working on, uh, containerless products. And so there's nothing uh, to wind up in the landfill or the ocean. And These are a hybrid of naked shower gel and naked body conditioner, is what Lush said. And these have approximately four uses. This will be the third regenerative shower oil that I'm going to try. And so now I'm gonna go use it at the sink and we'll see what it's like. Well. And you can see there's absolutely no lather whatsoever. And, um, you know, very little, uh, you know, it doesn't come off uh, onto your skin in, in chunks. Um, and it doesn't, you know, it feels like it's not even coming off on your skin at all. Um, but it is. And this co-washing, right? So I'm going to do it on my other arm now so you can see. And I'm just going to rub it back and forth with medium firm pressure. And you can see, I mean, it's like nothing even comes off on you. There's no suds. There's no lather. Um, there's not even any kind of oil. And so you're like, well, is anything coming off? And, but you still have to rinse it off, even though you don't see anything because it does have cocoa butter and whatnot in it. And now my skin feels is just like uh, it feels after I use one of their body conditioners that come in the black pot. It's not greasy, it's not oily, there's not stuff that you need to rub away or rub off. It's just moisturized. Uh, the water beads up on it, but it's not sticky, goopy, greasy, oily, or anything. It's just very moisturized. Um, you know, so it's, it's a matter of, well, do you feel clean or do you feel moisturized? Well, right now my arm feels both. So, and it certainly smells yummy. All right. Here's a picture I took of all of the products that Lush has ever made throughout the years with the Butterball scent. I would rate Peace Pioneer a four out of five rating. It's, it's, co-washing is a learning curve. 
and so it's better for my skin, especially because my skin is dry, but there is a learning curve, and that's why I knocked off a point for it. Also, it's very slippery in the tub. It makes the uh, surfaces of the shower very slippery, and so that's why this is, otherwise this would be a five, but I had to knock off a point for a couple of those things. So if you have any questions about Peace Pioneer, just let me know by commenting below. If you enjoy this video, please like my video by giving me a thumbs up down below. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel and that way you'll be notified whenever I upload a new Lush video or a psychic video, either one. Um, and again, thanks for watching my video, and we'll talk to you soon on the next video. Bye-bye. How many times can I say the word video? <laughs> talk to you later. Bye-bye.